So we recently just got some really interesting news to do with the production on the MCU Spider-Man 4 and everything that's kind of happening with that, that actually has led to the reveal now of who the villain of the movie is going to be and who the villains of the movie were originally going to be. Again, we now know that Null is going to be the main villain it looks to be of MCU Spider-Man 4 according to all the leaks and whatnot. But we also know that this movie was originally supposed to be a grounded movie and not the like multiversal movie that this is kind of like shaped into. So again, a recent report has come out here that does actually say that Scorpion, Prowler and Mr. Negative were all in talks to be the villain of Spider-Man 4. It says that according to the comic circus, Scorpion, Prowler, and Mr. Negative were all considered villains for Spider-Man 4. The film will no longer be street level uh, focused, instead will deal with a multiversal threat in Null, the god of symbiotes who will reportedly be the main villain. Again, I feel like this is just such a missed opportunity because I really think, when are we going to get Scorpion as a villain in an MCU Spider-Man movie? Again, he was teased all the way in the first Spider-Man movie, uh, Homecoming, of course, of the MCU, which we know. We saw an amazing performance of him in the Sinister Six in the Marvel Spider-Man game, and it just feels like we really need him to be the villain of a Marvel Spider-Man movie eventually. It's also like Mr. Negative. He is such an awesome villain. And what we saw of him in Marvel Spider-Man, you know, being Martin Lee, this guy who is extremely rich, who has all of these organizations around New York called Feast, which is like these homeless shelters, be this really awesome guy who Peter really respects and looks up to. And then eventually finds out that this guy is a legit like terrorist with what he does and is has this alter ego of Mr. Negative. I mean, that whole story and plot just legitimately sounds like something that would be ultimately made for movies. Again, we look at those two, obviously the Prowler that you see there, uh, which is right next to my face. We saw him as Childish Gambino. We saw some of his stuff in the, uh, you know, Spider-Verse movie. Again, there's Jaden Smith right here because it's rumored that Miles Morales was going to be in Spider-Man 4. Will that be happening now? Uh, probably not, but obviously this was most likely going to be considered, especially now that we know the Prowler was uh, supposed to have a role. And again, here is the Prowler in the Into the Spider-Verse or Across the Spider-Verse movie, which we saw some live action stuff of Childish Gambino, uh, of course, playing him. Again, that is no longer going to be the situation. It doesn't look like we're going to be getting Peter Parker and Miles Morales in the movie. And, you know, it, it literally is uh, what it is. But if they, as we know, had an idea for the Prowler to be in the film, which it very much looks like was the plan, that makes me think that they may have also had like a a Spider-Man, you know, Miles Morales type of thing that would potentially be happening. But again, these the three sets of villains here, man, the Prowler, Scorpion, and Mr. Negative. That is a awesome set of, you know, trio of villains. I don't I don't really love the Prowler as much as Mr. Negative. Like Mr. Negative is legitimately probably one of my favorite all-time Spider-Man villains now. But at the end of the day, I felt like they were, and potentially low-key kind of cooking up something there. But I guess now we know that that's just not going to be happening. Again, if you haven't already, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Comment your thoughts and opinions down below. What do you guys think of Null being the villain now instead of these other three that I've, of course, talked about in this video? Would you guys have rathered they go on street level and went with them. I'd very much like to know. Subscribe to my gaming channel, uh, which is my, my sports channel, my RL Slack for long channels. Links for them will be in the description down below. And I guess I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.